open our lab and office in Dubai as a global hub for the region and also for Asia and Africa. Our plans uh, for expansion in the Middle East include partnerships with leading hospitals and research centers in the different countries. And in the long term, what we would like to build is also localized data sets and reference genomes for the different populations. Unfortunately, today, most of the scientific research is based on Anglo-Saxon databases. And we already see how people in Italy and Spain react different to drugs that were developed using, again, Anglo-Saxon data sets. So we see really the potential to enable personalized medicine, not just as a standard global solution, but as customized solution for different countries. And this is true uh, for each one of the countries in the Middle East. This is also true in terms of reaction to medicines, in terms of variants that are genetic variants that are pathogenic, maybe in the United States, but they're benign here. So we really see the opportunity in the Middle East to work very closely with the local institutions, the local research centers and governments to enable a more personalized medicine and then to reverse the cycle where in the future people in the United States and Western Europe will be cured using drugs and therapies that have been developed here in the Middle East. We chose to come to Dubai uh, because we see Dubai really as a global hub uh, and really becoming the capital of the future. Dubai and the Emirates are investing in all the technologies and all the sectors that will help humankind to create a better world. From personalized medicine to environmental technologies to new, new physics technologies, AI. And so we chose Dubai really to, uh, to be our global hub. And then the Emirates also, we chose them as a safe, strong country with a vision that is also making big investments and is not afraid of dreaming big and then to attract talent and create opportunities that have an impact, not just for the Emirates, not just for the region, but really global impact across the world. <laughs>